All right, ladies and gentlemen, it's time for me to start taking characters from Mortal Kombat 11 into training mode and learning a little bit about them and then taking them onto online play. The first character I want to try is Shao Kahn, who is the character I got for pre-ordering the game. Typically, the characters that are pre-ordered characters aren't that great, just to warn everyone. Like, there was Goro, and Goro was kind of shitty, so I almost guarantee Shao Kahn will not be very good, okay? But I want to try him anyway. Um, he's two versions, Magic Might and Fiery Wrath. So Magic Might has Annihilation, Ground Shatter, and Uprat Hammer, while Fiery Wrath has a move called Skewered, Spear Charge, and Ridicule. So, I, I mean, I think he talks like, you weak, pathetic fool, right? That's what he used to do during the during the uh, boss fights of, of Mortal Kombat 1 and 2. So, well, 2, excuse me, he wasn't in 1. Um, shout out to Jacob Zen, who has also subscribed to the channel. Appreciate that, Jacob Zen, for the sub. <clears throat> hmm. So I guess we'll do I will try Magic Might, I guess. Let's try Magic Might variation. And it doesn't really matter who I fight. Here, we'll fight Raiden. He has three Light Fury Incandescence. Those two. Light Fury and Incandescence. I'll probably be using Incandescence because that's the one that has the combo that I like. A lot of uh, stages. Let's go random. Vote Democrat cheered and earned the new bit badge for 25k bits. Congrats, Vote Democrat. Thanks for the support. Alright, so here we are. This is Magic Mike Shao Kahn. Let's take a look at his moves list. Merciless Spear, Scum Grab, Uprat Hammer, Shoulder Charger... Annihilation, Ground Shatter, Hammer Lunge. Jesus Christ! Closer and further Hammer Lunge. He's got a lot of moves. Merciless Spear. That is a projectile. If you meter burn it, I don't think you can. Nope. Okay. Scum Grab. Seems like an anti air grab. Huh. What if he has a launcher and he can do it afterward? He probably does. See if he has like a combo where he can launch you. What sucks is none of these tell you if they're launchers or not. I hate that. The combo should tell you if it's a launcher, but they don't say that. There's an overhead combo. That's good. I'm going to need that. An overhead combo. Mix up. He very has very few low attacks. Good luck. Well, back in X is a launcher. And there's the combo. Yep. I wonder if this is an anti-air. It might be. You gotta be in the corner for the combo, I think. There's the meter burn. There's an additional hit. Okay. I'll have to mess around with his combos, but I want to see a special move. So the scum grabs an air anti-air and he'll do an extra smash. Uprath hammer. What the hell? He actually throws his hammer. And depending on what you press, it goes different distances. This is neutral. This is if you tap towards him, it lands right in front of him. If you tap away, it goes a little further. You can meter burn it, I think. No, you can't. No, you can't. Okay. Shoulder charger. Or amp meter burn. Ah, oh, it's a launcher. Or, if you hold down, it grounds. And it turns into an overhead. Oh, you saw that? It turns into an overhead, so it's different variations. Oh, no, I'm trying to I'm going over the shoulder here. Yeah, you can combo after that. Oh, 
Oh, I don't have any meter. I need it so that I auto recharge meter at full meter. Always. Let's see. Uh, how do I have full meter at all times? Don't see it. There's no way to have full meter at all times? Why? Full. There we go. Okay. Yeah, that's pretty good. That's corner only, though, I think. Yeah, it's too far away. Let's dash forward. Oh, you can do it. You dash forward. Oh, that's good, man. Computer burn that for double, but it's using two meters, but... That's pretty good basic combo. Okay. I also like how you can variate it into the overhead. So if they're blocking and they, they're trying to block low, you can mix it up to do an overhead during it. I like that. Yes, the landscapers are outside right now, guys. People are like, are the landscapers? What's the noise? Yes, those are landscapers. Annihilation. Go ahead. That's the threat hammer. This is Annihilation. It's command throw. Okay, can you meter burn it? Yes. Now we're doing extra damage. Okay. Now, I wonder, I doubt that juggles in midair. It does! Dude, that is cool. It juggles in midair. So he has an air grab or he has a command grab you can combo from an aerial juggle. That's kind of cool. Big damage right there. All right. Ground Shatter. I'm not sure what this does. This seems to be doing anything. What if you're close? What if you meter burn it? Okay. It's a two hit low, but it seems kind of shitty to me. It doesn't really do anything. It's not like Jax's Ground Pound, right? So I'm not sure if I'll ever be using that move. <laughs> Hammer lunge. Whoa! Okay. Oh, damn! Dude, you can go full screen. Now, what about meter burning? He catches you for an additional hit. I don't think you do a follow-up, though. Nah, it's too slow to follow up. That's cool. A full-screen overhead that could probably blow through moves and stuff, I would think. That's a pretty good move. Pretty risky, though. Now, apparently, people are saying I'm not using a tournament variation. I can't use this in ranked. What the fuck are you talking about? There's two moves lists. Or there's two versions, and I picked the one that was the first one. Why would this not be the, the one for tournaments? What are you talking about? How do you tell if you're using a tournament variation or not? What are you talking about? <laughs> Someone better explain this to me. Cam Jersey Chudy said he broke up with his girlfriend a few days back, so his stream is helping immensely. Thank you, Cam Jersey, for the cheer. Mr. Papa Fair Chudy said Landscaper is the true enemy of all streamers. And Rockstar Chudy said you should do the character tutorials also, Phil. Majibu says, I'm using the right move set. He's trolling me. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. What are you talking about? His sweep's really fast. Get into low. The two defaults are turning variations. The fuck are you talking about? If you go to customize, you'll see move lists for the characters that have trophies on them. These are the ranked versions. Well, unless anyone explains this to me, I'm not fucking playing. Fuck this. I'll just turn the game off. Seriously, what a pain in the ass. What are you talking about? That there's versions that you can and can't use in ranked play. How stupid is this? Look. Shall come. How do you... There's no trophy on either one. So what are you talking about? There's not a trophy on either Shao Kahn. Look. 
There's no trophy on either Shao Kahn. In fact, there's no trophy on any of these characters, so you don't know what the fuck you're talking about. Okay. So now we know not to trust people because they don't know what the fuck they're talking about. There you go. Wasting my time. Suck a surprise, you don't know what the fuck you're talking about. You have no idea because you said there were trophies on it. There's no trophies on it. So you have no idea what you're speaking of. There's no trophies in the select screen like you said there were. Oh my god. BWT says, I used the first variation of Shao Kahn online, so you're good. Alright, there you go. Alright, so I gotta figure out these combos. Jesus. Damn, it drops. Oh, once again, it reset my my options. Yeah, it did. There you go. You got to do it delayed. Mojo SD Chase. Unfortunately, it's true. You have to set the ranked variation in the customized menu where you can make variations... You go to the ability menu and press square. That's where the trophies show up like a heads up. What are you talking about? There's no customized menu in the practice screen. What are you talking about? Ah. Ah, oh, whiffs. Yeah, I don't think that one works. I don't think so. Okay. We're getting really angry right now. So people better fucking explain. I'm seriously angry. It isn't in the practice screen. It's its own menu off of the main menu. What the fuck is with this stupid game? It has a its own menu off of a main menu hidden in a menu. Okay, I'm in the main menu. Where do I go? Customize. This is it. Okay. Now what do I do? All I want to do is play characters and learn them. This is fucking bullshit. Click on a variation and go to abilities. Okay. Now what? What? Why am I even fucking doing this? Why am I doing this? Press square. True Khan and Risen Emperor. What is this? I don't know what this is. What just happened? I don't even know what happened. I 
don't know what's going on. I don't know what's... No one's saying anything now. So I'm supposed to equip move sets with X. Dude, this is the dumbest game I've ever fucking played. So before you can actually practice, you have to go to every character manually and select extra moves. Oh, fuck this. How do I just enable it by default? Because I'm not doing this. I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it for every character. I'm not going on them and doing that. So there better be a way to do this in options or something. Please, someone just tell me how to fucking do it without going through every character. I'm not wasting my time. This is the dumbest thing I've ever seen. I'm waiting. We're wasting. We'll sit here all fucking day, wasting all this time. Uh, I'll sit here and wait. Oh my god, I can't even click I can't even click on anything right now. So there's no default to just go to tournaments. You're serious. There's no way for me to just go tournament tournament ready. Instead I have to fucking do this for every character. You've gotta be joking me. Cause I'm not this is a waste of my time. So I have to go to Magic Might. Go to abilities, press square, go to true con, and hit X. Then I'm gonna go to this one, do this, go to abilities, press square, go to risen emperor, and hit X. You gotta be kidding me. I gotta do this for every fucking character? I don't even know what characters I'm playing. People are like, do it just for the characters you're gonna play. I don't even know what characters I'm playing yet. That's what I mean, this is fucking stupid. Unless I try the character out, how would I know if I like them? This is complete stupidity. Oh my god. So now I gotta do this for every character. Like, if I wanna play with Raiden later, what I need to do here is go on Light Fury, Click on it, go to abilities, press square, go down to Thunder Wave, and then press the button. And if I want to do incandescence, I gotta do this, go to abilities, press square, go down to Ryzen, and press the button. This is awful. This is fucking awful, dude. Now, is this even saving in other modes? Like, for example, now if I go into training mode to play with Shao Kahn, did it even save what I just did? This is really bad. Really fucking bad. Now, let's see. I'm hoping it changed. This is the one I want, the one with the up hammer and the ground, the gr command throw. I don't want the ground pound, the ground pound sucks. So this is the variation I want, if it did say. Well, thank you to Mojo SD for a 100-bit cheer. Thank you for Beer Tennis for a 350-bit cheer. 
Thank you for working tree for a 50 bit cheer. And Orcs of Dorks at a 500 bit cheer. Let's get Orcs or Dorks up there as the top cheerer. This is fucking stupid. This really is stupid that I have to do that for every fucking character. So now, I apparently have a tournament approved variation of Shao Kahn. So, Merciless Spear, Scum Grab. So, this is a new move. Dark Priest is a buff. Upwrath Hammer, Shoulder Charger, Annihilation, which is the command throw, Hammer Lunge, and the space, the distance of Hammer Lunge. Alright, so I don't have the stupid Ground Pound move, which sucked anyway, and I don't want it. But I have a new move called Dark Priest that apparently levels me up, powers me up. I wonder if it's just for one move. No, it looks like it lasts. Yeah. Huh. Okay. Looks like the problem is he doesn't really have an ability to move fast. Right? He seems like he's slow and he doesn't really have the ability to move too fast. Okay. So I know all his moves. What I want to do is figure out his combos. That's what I was trying to do before. The third hits an overhead. High mid overhead. That's the only overhead he has, I think. Damn. Oh, that's interesting. It's a low head. Meter didn't enable yet again. Why it resets that every time you fucking do this, I have no idea. That's really dumb. That's a good combo right there. Gustav, PC, 200 bits, and say, go kick some ass. <laughs> so that's that's a decent combo because it's high low, but if they're blocking low, it's not going to hit. You can also do into a mid. It's high, high. Too slow to recover to do anything after. You can combo the air throw. Yeah, it doesn't work. Okay. So it's a, it's a juggle, but it's not a good juggle because you can't really follow up after it. Yeah, see? Yeah, you can't really do anything after it. Everything misses. Yeah, everything misses. Okay. Orcs and Dorks says, imagine doing all this custom stuff at Evo. Dude, this seems like this game's going to be a nightmare in tournaments if this is the case. All right, just forward and triangle and then variations. High mid. Overhead. That's a mix up. High into overhead. This is mid, high mid mid, so that's not very good. Now Lee Fang tipped me two dollars. Says you got trolled into changing that stuff. The two preset variations are the tournament variations. That's why they are there to begin with. Uh, I don't know, man. Oh, that combos. Pretty good 
combos. Doing the wrong one. I wanted the lowest combo. What was it? That's high beat. I wanted the high low combo. What was the high low combo? I forgot it already. That one. So... I could do that, or what was the other combo? Oh, I could do... I could do that, right? Okay. I didn't do that, I did back and forth. Not comboing. I can't even get a three hit combo in this game because I can't play on fucking pad. I can't do the shoulder charge. That was back forward and I got command throw instead, which I didn't do. Too far away to combo that. Yeah, he is. So I can't combo that in midair. Damn. Hmm. Hmm. So I can do another shoulder charge. Or can I do maybe? Let me try this. Try the command throw. Nope, the command throw whiffs too, it looks like. Maybe I'll just not do that combo, do a different combo. There you go, that's better. Yeah, that's a better combo. It's light heavy or light light medium, whatever you want to say. That's a better juggle than the other one. This combo this combo just seems to that seems to suck. So what was the overhead combo? Because I'm going to need to use that to mix stuff up too. The overhead is square circle triangle. That wasn't the one I wanted, I don't think. Try it again. I thought there was another overhead it said. Yeah, this one. That's good, and that's good range. Look at that range. Pretty long distance range on that one. And it goes into an overhead. That's kind of good. I think I like that for his overhead combo. So essentially, you're trying to land this combo that goes low into the shoulder tackle, into the uh, meter burn so you can juggle. And then you could do any two or three hits into the command throw after it for big damage. If you get close, you could just go for the command throw. Like that. You could buff yourself in between for more damage. You got a projectile. That's good. Midstream projectile. It's kind of slow, though. It might not be as good as other projectiles. I don't know if it'll trade with other projectiles or go through. I don't know. Um, 
for me, I think his problem is maneuverability. I don't think his maneuverability is going to be too great. So there's no way to see what his, uh... There's absolutely no way, I don't think, to see what his fatal blow is, right? It's not even on here. There's no setting to enable fatal blow. Unless, let's see. Okay, we can see what his fatal blow is. You're stabbed. Ow. Looks pretty brutal. And it definitely looks like it can combo. It goes straight forward, so it looks like it can combo, right? I think so. Uh... BWT Cherry said, I haven't changed anything on anyone except gear, and I've been able to play online. I haven't even made my own variation yet either. I think people are full of shit. I think they don't know what they're talking about, quite frankly. When they're telling me this tournament variation bullshit, I don't think people knew what the hell they were talking about. I'm serious. Because why is it people were playing online and didn't have to change anything? Oh, my God. Anyway, Vote Democrat did a 550-bit cheer about buying par parts from a guy online. I don't know what the hell he's talking about. And I don't know what he's talking about. Contact PayPal. You're asking the wrong person. It's also not the time to be bringing that shit up because it's supposed to be a stream of me trying to play Mortal Kombat not interacting with you about parts you bought online. It went Thomas Street said, how's the negative edge? I don't know, I disabled it. Supposedly I disabled it, so it doesn't... Yeah, let's see if I release the button. It shouldn't do a special move. Yeah, I disabled negative edge, so stop fucking stuff up. Uh, Kevin subscribed to the channel. Thank you, Kevin, for the sub. And, uh, Rockstar Chase said, After training with Shao Kahn, if you go to tutorial, then characters, it's worth it. Plus, you get a skin. Oh, yeah. Yeah, but isn't that going to show you all his moves? And I don't have all his moves with this variation. I, at this rate, I'm never going to get to fucking play online. Seriously. <laughs> at this rate, I'll never play the game online. Oh, my God. I already unlocked him. This character lessons. Fuck this. I'm going to play on... What? I pressed circle and it went into character lessons. It basically teaches you all his moves. The Shao Shimmy. Con Kick. Look at this. Hammer Slammer. Alright, fuck this. I'm going to play online. I'm tired of waiting. All right. I'm seriously tired of fucking waiting. <laughs> 